Hey everybody, and welcome back to Falcon Place Neil Scavenger. Um, we're still in the same life for like probably what three, four episodes now, which is pretty impressive, quite honestly. And let's hopefully keep that same uh success on by going forward here. And we're going to the glowing area uh, off in the distance. There are basically our Emerald City, so to say. And hopefully we could uh, get some answers. So right now, um, I found some subreds we're going to check out with some strong and some lighting. If even if we alert stuff, it doesn't really matter because uh, we're badasses. Metal saucepan. I'm not going to take that. And uh, some pieces of an old newspaper. Agrisanta congealed grease popsicles meat without the heat. Okay. Now let's go ahead and drink this water that we found here. Eh, that's pretty much about it. So cancel this out and let's proceed on forward here. And two. And we got one more. Now the problem is it's about to get nighttime again, and I don't want to be out in the open in the nighttime. So I need to start looking for somewhere to kind of uh, call it. Okay, we're gonna. How is our injuries doing, by the way? Pretty good. All right, so let's actually go into the crafting menu because we found a river here, and that's gonna let us get some extra water. That's always good. And let's go ahead and get uh, some of this water in us. There, hydrate as much as possible. Excellent. We're getting a little bit tired, but. Again, nighttime is only almost upon us, and I want to hopefully not run into that bandit for sure. Let me scavenge around here. There's an open field. Do a little botany. Nothing useful is found. And all right, I'm going to move away from the bandit. Maybe he'll do the same for us. And okay, we're left completely in the fucking dark. Which is uh, not good. Let me end my turn here. I really would have liked to have been in some foresty area. Oh, there's a city over here. It looks like a city. If it looks like a city and acts like a city, it's probably a city. Uh, that's not really how that goes. That's not even a saying in reality. And turn. Okay. So we're going to hang out in here. Let's scavenge in here while we're here, by the way. Scavenge in here while we're here. That makes perfect sense. Uh, okay. This is going to probably alert stuff to us, but I want to see if we can find some good stuff. Hey, look. More night vision goggles. Hey, you know what? I'm a fucking imbecile. I have night vision goggles. Why aren't they on? Okay. So here's what I'm going to do. Uh, put this on here, and we're gonna turn these shits on. Insufficient charges to switch- what? What do you mean insufficient charges? Ah, oh, what about the ones that I- that I already had? Ah. Oh, why? How do I charge them? Oh, obviously, the contents say empty. That would make sense. Okay, well, so much for having night vision goggles when the fucking battery doesn't work. Alright, uh, this is the same thing. Hey, painkillers. Yeah, alright, let's go ahead and, uh, get fucked up. <laughs> let's go ahead and Robert Downey shit this, uh, Robert Downey this up. Alright, uh, hydrocodine. Okay, let's use this. Now I've taken some painkillers and our pain is kind of going up, so... Yeah, alrighty. Uh, did you take those as well? Okay, I, I think probably one's enough for now, <laughs> so... Uh, let's actually take one of these canisters with us because that is a lot of pills, and... It seems like it's actually pretty useful to us. So let me put this pill set there and let me just take this one that has a lot of pills into our box here. Good. And I would say that's about all we really need. Unless dirty rags. Where are my dirty rags? At? Can I take more dirty rags? I can. Cool. So there you go. All good to go. Let's uh, continue on. That was a pretty good uh, era. It's going to alert people to us, right? But at least it was pretty good in that respect. Um, I am worried about people coming out. Oh, look, another city. Okay. So jump over here and turn. Now, here's what we're going to do for this one. Let's scavenge without alerting people to us. How about that? Um. Um. Scavenging a hex. Not, the loot isn't that good, honestly. So how about we just, uh, we can camp out here. But I'm tired, so let's see if we could just, um... Go and do a regular sleep, I'd imagine, and hopefully it sticks this time. All right, we slept a bit, but then we woke up because we are insomniacs. So let's try it again. I'm going to try to sleep through the whole night, honestly. Players for and paint colors are wearing off, and... Cool. All right, well, they're wearing off, but we're pretty good. Oh, uh, well-fed, well-rested. Let's try to sleep once... I mean, it's the middle of the night. Oh, what the hell is this? What is this just doing hanging out here? Okay, um, let's please take that when we get the chance. See if we can sleep a bit more. Come on, man. Get some sleep. Oh, middle of the day now. Not going to want to sleep now, but all right. Let's just look around here. Oh, crowbar with a strap? Why? 
Okay, uh, let's drink this water. Uh, plastic bag. More dirty rags for us. Birds are the word. Bird is the word. But, 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 but. Okay, I'm not going to do that for you. State biologists are trying to determine what killed an estimated 500 birds in Point Coop Parish. Authorities say the birds all suffer from the spontaneous blood clots falling suddenly along a 10-mile stretch of Louisiana Highway 1. This comes out three days after more than 3,000 blackbirds fell from the sky in BB, Arkansas, also without an explanation. Man, you know, shit was just falling and dying around us when, uh, I guess the, uh, civilization went to shit there, so that's pretty interesting indeed. Alright, so, let's, uh... That water bottle and wait, what are you doing? Did I gotta turn you over? Fine, I'll turn you around. All right. Um, string. Oh, well, got the string now, but too late for that. I don't really care anymore. Okay, what else can we do here? I can't put the plastic bag in there and then put stuff in the plastic bag. I wish that was the case, though. Just kind of cheat the system a bit. All right, so there's nothing else around us other than this crowbar, but. Crowbar with a strap. What would this be needed for? That's really weird. Okay. Um, we... Have we scavenged here? I, I guess we did. Alright. Uh, there's another city up here. Let's, let's check. Oh, there's a lot of stuff here, as a matter of fact. So let's scavenge this really quickly. An abandoned warehouse. Right, right, right. Let's do all this. Uh, found some items. And what do we find? Oh, the Fort Caster Wheel. But now we have no sled. Hey, we found a Coke as well. So let's go ahead and drink this. Yeah, I know it's gonna make me, uh, heat exhausted again, but at least we're kind of well-rested now. More rags for us. Oh. I guess we can't do any more rags. Uh, I do want to take this caster wheel, though, because, uh, that is kind of what we've been, um, saving these things for. So, let's put you in there as well. Why can't... it's three spots. You... Oh, is it four spots? Oh, it's four spots. My bad. Okay, here's what I'm going to have to do. I hate having to do this. It's kind of annoying, but, um... We are going to momentarily... Or actually, you know what? Um... No, we definitely need to move that out of the way. So, how about we just empty this out momentarily? Uh, it's kind of annoying, but... What can you do about that? Put that in there. Put that back in there. Cell phone battery right there, and put this lighter right there. Let's put all the wheels in this box if we can, just to kind of keep them all um, together and whatnot. So now we have four wheels, meaning we are kind of close to kind of uh, building us that frame. I mean, we got the shopping cart frame. I forgot what else we need, but there's a few more items. But we're we're getting really really close, as a matter of fact. That would be pretty cool, just kind of walk around the wasteland with my own shopping cart. And, uh, we definitely want to keep on to the binoculars, but now I definitely do not have room for them. We definitely want my... Pills for sure. Pills here. Okay, and... We could put something in there. Alright, let's empty this out as well. How about that? Oh, what did I do? Okay. Wait, wait a minute. What did I do last time where it... Shit. Uh, I'm a little bit confused as to what just happened here. Oh, I guess I have to... Okay, I see. I see. Uh, put this like so, and then... Uh, rags are definitely a good thing, because that's been kind of keeping us afloat here. I put all the water bottles right there. Pills right there, and let's see what else can we put in there. Bullets for sure. Want to keep on to those? Fuck that glass ship. Doesn't even done anything for us. Hmm. Yeah, let's just do it that way. How about that? Uh, and we have all four wheels in here, and we have we're gonna have almost six bottles of water, so that's actually pretty good. And rags. I'm saying fuck you too, and I think that works out, right? We're not leaving anything crucial behind. We have four wheels, right? We do. Okay. That's, that, that works out for me. Uh, let's um, check out my crafting menu. Known recipes and shopping cart. We need pliers, Phillips head screwdriver, mechan- Oh, we don't have the mechanic skills, though. We can't build it? What's the point? Oh, man, I don't know. Well, 
we'll hold on to it for now just because there's nothing really immediately around us that we could, you know, profit from better, so. For now, we'll wait it up. Uh, I have diarrhea now. That goddamn Coca-Cola, man. I'm telling you. A scavenger, right. A crumbling apartment building. Okay, well, this is going to be kind of terrifying because it could fall and kill us, and it didn't. It gave us a sled instead. And an atlas. Oh, smartphone. <gasps> okay. Quality torch. Two small kindlings, one medium shaft. <laughs> oh, it never gets sold. And a small, flammable, non rigid sheet. Okay. Um, well, here is the, um, here's the thing. How do I use this? Can I, is it on? <gasps> it's on. It's locked, though. Yeah, it would be. So, put this off, and... Interesting. Interesting indeed. Uh, let me take the cell phone just in case. No, no real reason not to. And let me... Yeah, cool. So that was a good find. Let me go into the crafting menu really quickly here. So I have a sled, right? And I have, uh, wheels. I got four wheels as a matter of fact. What can you make... What can you do with this, guys? That's the real question. Uh, where's the other wheel? Four wheels. Nothing. Um, maybe I'm missing like a skill or something. A sword screws. Any twigs, maybe? No? <laughs> it's like maybe with the twigs it'll come. Maybe some dirty rags. You want some dirty rags? You want a piercing tool? Take it all. You use a binocular. I don't care. <laughs> Just make something happen. Electric charge? What? Where's that from? Okay, I don't think we have anything at all. Um, electric charge? What? What was that? It's from the. It's probably from the batteries, right? But how does that even work? No, don't want to destroy that. Oh, the condos is empty. Oh, right, you want know fuck that then? Um, interesting. Interesting indeed. All right, whatever. Uh, so nothing else here. It seems uh we're unhurt. We're kind of getting a little bit thirsty, but we have water for that, and well, there's actually some water right here, as a matter of fact. So let's just end our turn. No, we don't end. We have... No, no, that's not what I'm trying to do. We have a marsh. Okay. I'm going to do it with the marsh, get some water from the marsh for sure. All right, there you go. Perfect. Now we got our water since we're thirsty. Let's hydrate up a bit. Cool, and what are these? Poison berries. I don't want them. You can keep your poison berries. Eh, let's continue going on. We're oh, another city. Excellent. End our turn. Alright. And it's crashing after a caffeine sugar high. And I'm still having diarrhea. Oh, it's a lot of stuff here. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Um, I'm terrified as to what could happen about the diarrhea. I'm almost tempted to use one of those, you know, nano things really quickly. But I'll hold on for it. Let's scavenge here for now. And, uh... Let's just do all that. We found some items. Medium length of... Oh, a medium length. Okay, this is actually a bit stronger than um, the other stuff that we've been rolling with. So, really quickly, uh, Lighter, you go and hang out in there. And let's uh, put that in there. A little bit more water. And uh, I don't think water is really helping my diarrhea right now, <laughs> by the way. Okay, and this tells you how to make the, the rifle. Another bottle, but we need that. Next week, uh, data of, on Data Fish, Lucy finds herself on thin ice as... Ha, ah, Data Fish, thin ice. I get it. All right, and, well, seems like about it. Um, if I combine all this... Oh, it does make it. Excellent. That's what I imagined would happen. Okay. Craft that. Craft that. Okay, so basically, you can make a lot of, uh, a lot of medium, you need, what is it that you need? What is it? No, this is a medium, right? No. This is a handful, right? So it seems like about three of these make up, um, the medium length. So, this is probably what I should have done when with the sled, I mean, had I known that you could kind of, uh, just combine these by themselves. There you go. Now we have a lot of medium length rope. Can we carry it, though? And the answer is, uh, we could carry some of it. Not all of it, but some of it, maybe, right? No, we could carry all of it. Good. All right. Well, this guy got left behind. Can I put him in? Yep. All right, good. So we got all the medium length rope. So we could find a sled again. We could give us another shot. All right. And that's, um, we're tired. Maybe we could... No, let's not sleep just yet. 
There's a lot of cities here, as a matter of fact. Or not a lot of cities, but a lot of civilizations for us to check out. Part and building. I alerted stuff, and another backpack. Well, I mean, I like backpacks. The thing is, you can't put a backpack in a backpack. You can't uh, double stamp or triple stamp either. You can't do that, Lloyd. Or can't triple stamp and double stamp, I should say. Oh, man, I'm really excited for Dumb and Dumber 2, the real sequel, by the way. Okay, anyway here, Dirty Rags. This doesn't look really much of interest here. No. I mean, I like that bag for sure, but... Oh! Wait. Wait a minute. Ha ha ha! Yeah! All right. You gotta use your brain a bit sometimes, and good things happen. I mean, I'm talking to myself, obviously, here about that. I'm the fucking moron playing this game. There you go. So now we have two bags that we're rolling with. And it doesn't seem like we are under or over over our carrying limit, I should say. There's another dude I just saw kind of roam around. Oh, there's a lot of shacks here, too. This is actually pretty cool. All right. Let's, uh, ooh, another city there, too. I feel like a child with, like, ADD right now. It's like, ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. All right, uh, let's check out this shack in the forest here. And, okay, we could definitely find something of interest here, it seems. I found something. Ooh, a sleeping bag. Yes. Okay. Good. We got some good shit happening right now, let me tell you. Confirm that. Craft. What can I do with the sleeping bag? Nothing. All right. I'm just testing it. You never know, apparently, what could happen with all these items. As long as you throw them in there, just... Oh, what the hell happened here? Oh, and that's... Um, Alright, anything else for us to check out here? It doesn't seem that way. So let's jump into this shack here. And my turn. Alright. And scavenge accordingly and do the storage shed. Strong. Lighter. I got somebody's attention, but it doesn't really matter. And we got a rifle scope here. Uh. Go there. Another multi-tool, but this one's about to break, so the hell with that. Firm that. Okay, and we could scavenge some trees as well. Use my botany skill, and strong, I suppose. And nothing was found. All right. So let's go and jump down into this big-ass city over here. It seems, oh, there's a few raiders or bandits, one or the other. We'll end our turn, though, and maybe they'll come after us. Maybe they won't. They're dancing around me right now. They're doing some sort of tribal dance to kind of scare me. It's not going to work, though, assholes. Believe me. What do we have here? Oh, we have two of them. They're going to actually try to come at me. This guy is feeble, he's frail, and he's uh, barefoot. And the other guy is the same thing. He's got a hunting rifle. Three of these guys are coming at me right now. Um, I would fight them, but there's three of them, and one of them might have a rifle that works. Or has bullets, I should say. So for now, let's just take cover and see what happens. Um... Looter is taking cover and is harder to hit with ranged weapons. Looter retreats from player. Okay. Hunting rifle dude's still around. There's two hunting rifle dudes? No, no, it's just one. Okay, so let me go ahead and, uh... Let me advance under cover. Okay. Looter retreats from player. Alright, so only the dude with the hunting rifle's next. So let me advance under cover. Do the thing again. I want to get that gun off him, to be quite honest. And he ran away from me. You asshole. He desperately retreated from me. Yeah, you get out of here, you fucking scumbags. This is my fucking uh, neck of the woods, all right? So let's go and scavenge here and... Oh, oh. Okay. So first aid. Let me quickly empty this out, right? And this does have indeed pills. And uh, empty this out. And this does have pills, so empty that out. What about you? You do definitely have pills, so empty it out as well. Okay, so... In terms of pills, this is all we got here. And I know that I have... What happened to my pills? They're in the bag, right? Yes, they are. Um, okay. So let's go ahead and just put that in the bag. The bag would be our pill area, let's just say. Just put the goddamn pills in there. Why can't you put them in? Pills in there. Alright. Oh, clean rags. That would be awesome, actually. Nine of them. Good. Okay. Um, how about this? How about we just empty this out again? The trouble spot about doing is you have to kind of do this once again, but that's fine. All right, so put that in there. Uh, let's take the clean rags this time. No, we don't need that. Take some bullets, obviously. Take the pills. 
So take the pills, and uh, I feel like I'm trying to date rate somebody here. Take the pills, baby. No, you're, you'll be fine. You won't wait. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna get off that subject now. Okay, and that's pretty much it, I'd imagine. I could take the dirty rags, but you know what? Fuck it, we got some glean rags now. You know, from rags to riches is what I say, so put that on. Put the bag next to you. All right, we're good to go now. We don't need this first aid kit thing. Uh, we, the sled is here, though, so... um. Let's go into our crafting menu, and let's give this a, re a real try now. So we got the plastic sled, and we have some medium-length cords. What is this going to do? It's going to it's gonna reverse the effect. <laughs> That's not what I was going for. What if I give it some wheels? How about that? So it's like a cool thing, just kind of like rolling about with a string attached to it. Where's the fort wheel? Fort wheel? Uh-oh. Don't tell me I somehow lost the Ford wheel. That would be pretty silly of me. Dude, where is it? Okay, wait a, wait a minute. No, there's four wheels in that box, okay? Game, stop fucking around with me. Where did you put the Ford wheel? What? What in the actual fuck is happening here? Where's the Ford one? There's four of you! Well, I'm a little bit perplexed as to what the fuck's happening. Oh, wait, wait. There we go. Four wheel. <laughs> Scary. Scary stuff. All right, go back. And now, let's go ahead and put four wheels there. We'll put the sled. This is probably isn't even a recipe, by the way. I'm just probably over here, uh... Yeah, not a recipe. <laughs> Maybe I put some screws in it. That's what she said. Uh, nope. Nothing. Nothing at all. Maybe with trapping. Nope. Okay. Well, I tried. It's probably not even a recipe. I'm just kind of like, you know, really reaching here, honestly. I haven't read any comments right now from uh, this actual run. So, um, if you are yelling after, like, a first video, like, stop it. That's, you can't build anything with that. I apologize. I just haven't gotten around to the... Well, I've probably read them by now, but as the time as I'm recording this, I haven't actually seen them. It's a problem. Outdoor temperature is falling pretty low. I'm overheating, actually. So it's the, quite the opposite. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's anything here, so let's just end our turn. These guys are going to dance back and forth. And I'm suffering from heat exhaustion. Okay, that's not good. Um, Let's uh, check out our item screen. Maybe if I take my blue jeans off. Put Dogman fur coat off. I, I want to get the... How do I get the gown off of me? And you are getting colder. Well, <laughs> this guy, you can't have it both ways, okay? It's you're either hot or you're cold. You can't have both. Put the pants back on. And put the brown shirt back on. Put brown shirt back on. You are comfortable. Okay, so I'm in between right now. Dogman fur coat. There you go. We're good. So as long as we took the hospital gown off, we're pretty good now. So there you go. Gown off. I don't look I don't look as crazy anymore with the hospital gown on, apparently. Alright, what is this? A bit looter? Yeah, fuck you, looter. What are you gonna do? Come at me? Wanna see you try it. Alright. And nothing here. And oh look at this, we're getting there. Alright, so let's uh Oh, what the hell is this? Let's uh scavenge about. Ah, uh, we could definitely use some water, so why not give the lake a chance here? And go into our item screen, and let's just drink all this shit up. Good. Get on out of here, and let's just jump into the city here. And scavenge about, there's an abandoned apartment building, and I'm gonna use a lighter to scavenge it out. And we found us a uh, soup can, empty one. Some ketchup. I see another newspaper. Life's a beach when you die. Of oh, smallpox. <laughs> Not life's a bitch, but life's a beach. Uh, Charleston's health authority said uh, Tuesday in investigating 12 new smallpox cases, including one that has been linked to an emergency landing of a private watercraft in the Atlantic. A number of the reported cases involve visitors to the South Carolina beaches. Uh, Dr. Sun O'Reddy, senior medical officer at the Southern or the South Carolina Health Department, has ordered a general curfew of all the beaches in the area into an investigation can be conducted into the into the cause. All right, so apparently, 
people were fucking getting smallpox again and uh, animals were dying, so a little bit of understanding what was happening on. Alrighty, and uh, I don't think we need that, honestly. Well, I mean, no reason not to take it since we have the room for it, I'd imagine. There you go. Alright, all good there. I'm well fed, well hydrated, I'm a little bit tired. But I'm pretty good with everything else still, so... How about... Let's just, uh... Let's see if we can try to get some sleep. Probably won't work, but, you know, who knows. I had trouble falling asleep, and as I was falling asleep, a looter showed up, so yeah, fuck that, never mind. Stay awake. And I ran into a looter, as a matter of fact. I'm just gonna, you know, threaten this guy, maybe he'll run away. He did. He's a coward. Another city here, let's end our turn, and we will scavenge the city now. Abandoned building. Anything of interest? Yep, there's a few items. Another tarp. Let's take the tarp with us. And let's see here. Papa, Cornicola. Please, uh, we already read that one before. Okay, and let's just check out the other um, monument that was here for us to check out. Strong. That. We found ourselves a rifle with a strap. That's the second one of those, so I'll hold on to it for now. Alright, that's about it for this area. Let's jump into this marsh area and go into the... I don't need a hydrate right now. Let's jump over here and end our turn. Good, nothing happened. Keep going through the open plains. There's, a little sh There's actually a few little shacks that we kind of want to check out, so let's end our turn here and we will jump. Okay, it's getting uh, dusk now, so let's jump over here. I'm carrying a moderate load, and their movement rate is slower. Okay. Uh, so we might have to start thinking about uh, either dumping some shit or putting in a base, but we don't have a base, so we're going to have to definitely go with the latter, which is dumping some stuff away. So let's end our turn here. And as soon as it's our turn again, we will scavenge this area, and we will drop some stuff, essentially. Stuff that we don't really need. Find another monkey wrench. Uh, pretty good condition, as a matter of fact. So, um, let's see here. 31.6. Alright, so we don't need the scope, so you could go F yourself, basically. Uh, I'm gonna need this empty thing. We have a sleeping mag. You know what? Let's actually try to use the sleeping mag right now. I'm over here complaining about, you know, oh, I'm tired. Oh, uh, yeah, it's taking some painkillers, and let's see about Monkey Run. Monkey Run is pretty heavy, though. Maybe I don't want the Monkey Run after all. Uh, I have gastroenteritis. <laughs> Where are you blind? Okay, so really quickly here, let's go into the camp menu. Um, I can't go into the camp menu. Well, I can go into, but I can't really do much about it. Tired, I'm actually... I was trying to get some sleep. Apparently the looter tried to come at me when I was uh, sleeping, though. This guy has a crowbar, too. Are you really sure you want to do this, man? I will charge at you, and I would fucking murder your shit, so... Yeah, yeah, you better run away. Alright, so I can't fall asleep with these assholes around me, unfortunately. So let me just jump over here. These, uh... Looters are gonna be trouble, unfortunately. So... Let's, uh, have them run off. God, now it's the middle of the night. Okay, so, uh... Camp menu. No camp. Okay, unfortunately I can't use any of this shit here. Uh, I just wanna go to sleep. I mean... Uh, Wait a minute. Um, how do I go about doing that? Why can't I just use the sleeping bag? I don't understand. Okay, player is in a campsite with an average sleeping bag. Okay. Oh, I'm using sleeping. Oh, what? I just put it in my inventory. He does it. Okay. Um. Sleep. Uh, yeah. Go ahead and sleep in the sleeping bag, I guess, if that's what you're doing. What? What the hell is... What? Something is around me, apparently. What is this? This is kind of scary. Okay, I woke up, and... What the fuck is... Oh, I'm in a campsite for sure. Uh, well, I'm kind of well-rested now. Where's my sleeping bag? Do I have to? What, what happened to my sleeping bag? Sleeping bag? Is it just in the... 
Oh, there it is. Sorry. Campsite. Oh, because I'm using it in the campsite. Okay, I get it. So go to sleep now. And again, this guy. You know, you need to go away, man. Honestly, you need to just leave me the fuck alone. Let me sleep, all right? Oh, he's searching for me. All right, I'm gonna have to, you know, melee attack this man right now. Looter. Oh, he bruised my upper chest with a punch. All right. Oh, he uh, lashed out. So let me try to dodge his next attack. Looter falls back from player. Looter is bleeding. Okay, so he's bleeding now. Let me go ahead and. He oh, he's falling back from. Now oh, he's running away now. Okay, you asshole. Oh, to sleep now. See if it works now. I doubt it since this guy's kind of like all up and around me. It's this goddamn looter. Goddamn, just leave me alone, dude. You either fight me or you don't fight me. It's one or the other. Stop trying to loot me when I'm asleep, you coward. No, Durant's demand surrender. Looter desperately tries to retreat from the player. Okay. Um, let's see what the stretch of forest has for us, because this guy's kind of really, really being a pain in my D right now. now let me go ahead and uh, hydrate up really quickly here. So, oh, this is all edible. Good. Could definitely use some food as well. You know, this is probably what gives me the runs now that I think about it. <laughs> Eating all this fucking water with nothing but berries. It's kind of really disgusting, honestly. I apologize for that. Alrighty. I think we're good to go, though. Yeah. Alright, so let's end turn here. I guess I feel this is a wrong on, run on long enough, so let's go ahead and call it an episode here. This is probably a really extra long one just because I kind of lost track of the time. And a lot's been happening, too, so... Once again, guys, hopefully you're in the series so far. If you are, go ahead and leave a like. It's really easy to do. You just click that thumbs up button and it lets me know that you're enjoying the series and if you'd like to see more and I will continue going on with this uh, journey that we got going on here, which is running pretty far off, really, honestly. It's really impressive how much I've lasted. But either way, guys, uh, I will catch you next time.